Hello everyone and welcome to another easy DIY. Um, today we're going to be discussing uh, this TCL Roku TV and connection issues or connection issues that you might run into. And so what happens is if you use this TV like I do, uh, I mostly use it for a computer screen, but, but you could obviously use it as a regular TV and I use it with the uh, the cable app so it's um, strictly Wi-Fi or connected to a computer but what happens is uh, it has a hard time connecting to to the internet through Wi-Fi so I'm going to show you uh, what you can do to potentially fix the issue I was running into and what you want to do is on, on the remote you want to go into the secret menu which is the home button you hit it five times and then you hit the forward play reverse reverse forward play and that should get you into the menu so let's do that right now one two three four five forward play reverse reverse forward play uh, you might have to do it a couple times one two three four five or maybe faster there we go. So you want to be in this menu and then you want to scroll up to the wireless secret menu. And this is going to take you to this screen. And so what happens is if it's not connecting, it's going to show just um, no color on the bars. Or you won't see, uh, you might not see any colors on the bars or, or color on the bars or it might be really low. Uh, but the only thing I've seen is no colors on the bars if it's not working and the numbers might all be low or zero. So that's that's what happened in my instance. But what you wanna do is you see this uh, resets button. You can hit resets and I'm just gonna do it for, for educational purposes because it's gonna basically reset everything and I'm gonna lose my connection. So let's just go ahead and do that right now. So what you wanna do is hit driver reset and you'll see everything goes blank and kind of like repopulates. And luckily for me, it just started up where it left off. But for for most of you, you're going to have to go back and then try connecting to uh, the internet once again. So after resetting the drivers and you're still getting, and you try connecting again and you're still not getting anything, what you might need to do is um, you might need to move the TV and just kind of, Try playing with different angles to 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 improve the signal, and that's what I actually ended up doing, and it worked for me. And now it's uh, connecting consistently. So try that also, or try that as well. But for me, it's working right now. So hopefully this works for you. And remember, be patient with these TVs, they are pretty slow when connecting to, to a wireless connection. And, and even when you turn it on, it could take up to like five minutes to connect. So uh, there's that also. So if you find this helpful and, and this worked for you, go ahead and please leave a like and uh, feel free to subscribe and thank you for watching.